how you all doing? So today I'm here to walk you guys through the process of how to build a stone arch. I have already cut my stone. I have a, another video where I go through, I explain to you guys how to mark out your stone. I'll leave that video down in the link there. And also how to cut your keystone. This keystone here, I made it from a, a, a jumbo stone. There's a link will be in the description of how I, um, I have a video hub showing you guys how I make this keystone. Okay, let's dive right into the video. Before we jump into the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already subscribed for more fun videos like this one. Let's get started. All right, so first thing we want to do, we want to measure our window and to catch the center. Let's measure. Okay, this window is a five feet window. So we need to go 30 inches and then we're gonna plumb it up. It's right in the center here. This is the center of the window here. Reason why I'm catching the center because I want to know where to place my keystone. Because we want to have our keystone right in the in the center of the window. Okay, so now, now that's our center of our window. Okay, now we have the center of our window. Our next step is to put our keystone up here. You know, what, let, let's put some duct tape up here to see now this. Um, yeah, have duct tape, Matt. Chris. Yeah, no keep green. Yeah. Alright, well look like me down here. No, 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 no. Yes, yes. You have? Yes, yes. Just pass him through here. Here, uh, my hand is right here, sir. Yeah. Thank you. You saved the day, Mr. Green. Oh. Hey, guys, Mr. Green saved the day. He is the only one who have some duct tape here inside today. Okay, it's very important to tape your joints or tape your seam, whichever you want to call it. So that's what we're doing now. Okay guys, so okay, we catch the center of our window. Our next step is to put our, key, our keystone up here and mark it right onto our, our, our wall. So just like so, we're gonna put it right in the center. You wanna measure, set mark the center of your keystone, line it up with the center of the window, and put your level. Oops, I need to get my level. Okay, so we wanna put our level right on top. Once we have our level, we wanna level our stone. Make sure you get the center of the window. Just like so. So as you see, I put my level up top to level it. This is the keystone. Once I get it level, I mark it right here. Now we know where our keystone is gonna, gonna come. Okay, take this down now. Now we're gonna start our arch. To mark out this side of the arch, it's over here, we already started, but I'm gonna show you guys what I did over there. I just get a stone, I cut this stone 10 inches. This is the, the height I like to work my arch. And I just place it right on, let it sit right onto my arch, just like so. And then I just marked it. This is just one way of, of doing the arch. There is, a, there is, I think there's like three different ways we, you can you can cut it out. This is probably one of the easiest way you can do it. Okay, so I mark it. Now I need to fill inside here to the mark that I have. I just see here. So the first stone I line it up, and as you see, I sit it sit right onto my heart, because that's how you're gonna catch the the um, the form of the heart. You have to sit it the stone. Let it sit flush, flush with the arch and then you mark right up there as you see my mark is on the inside So we're just gonna follow that mark to start our first arch Keep on watching you see as we go you got it right. yeah. Ok, 
Okay, so now we, 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 we go over here. Okay guys, I like to put a brick size. As I see here, I catch my first stone. I have um, I have my mark. Same thing you wanna check for. You wanna make sure your stone is sitting flush with the window. I'm gonna give you a close up look in a minute. Let's put our brick ties right now. So now, just one a quarter. Beautiful. Okay, so this is the bottom of our arch. This is the bottom of our stone. As you see, it's flush right onto the window. It's very important because this is how you're gonna farm your arch. If you don't have it, so for instance, you have a gap out here or a gap out here, you won't have a perfectly round arch. You wanna make sure you sit your stone flush right onto your heart, go right around. Keep on watching, you see as we go. Let me do oh. Okay guys, another thing you wanna check for, over here we start with two full. Over this side, over here we're gonna start with two full and then afterwards we're gonna start by cutting. I don't have money. You know what, let's start with our, our cut right now. So it looks like we've started to cut from here. So this one needs to be cut. So we're just gonna cut it, take, our, take a little piece. The reason why we're cutting half an inch, because we want, we want to have a more tighter joint. So we're just gonna mark a half an inch here to finish right up to here. Half an inch down here to bring right up to this. We're just gonna mark it down straight down like this. I'm just gonna use my level, but because I'm, I can't use more than one at a time, I'm just demonstrating by just like, let's try and see if I can do it for you guys. Just like that. So we're just gonna mark her down just like so. And we're just gonna cut all of them like that. That way we have a tighter joint. Okay guys, so let's start with our cuttings now. Let's see how I do that one, eh? Yo! for me One more guys and then to put some brick ties. Just wanna make sure your stone sits flush and to your window. That's how you're gonna farm your heart. So don't forget that. Very important. Another thing you want to always make sure you have as well, if you have over here two full ones, you want to count 
make sure you have the same over this side. So over this side here, as you see, this is a full one because of the joint change as we go up here. The harsh uh, molding change. So now we just gotta uh, just keep on follow the size of the joint. We're trying to aim for like a, a three-inch joint. Don't want it to be too big, nor you don't want it to be too tight. So let's see. Put another brick tile here. When I'm doing art, I like to use the ton load of brick tile guys because I just want to make sure that it holds properly, you know. Okay, so for this one, we're just gonna mark half an inch over this side, half an inch up top, same thing over here, same thing here. I'm just gonna take our measurement. This looks like it's gonna be around two inches for down here, and up top here gonna be one and a half inches. Should be the same over the other side as well. Two inches, grown off to inch and a half. So guys, this is my keystone, and this is how I anchor it. This is basically how I anchor it. Now we're gonna just here, put a nail in, a pin in there to hold it in place. Okay, shape it okay guys, as you see here, we finish. We finish the setup our hatch now. We just need to do our jointing. Let's keep going. Yeah, I come up a bit higher, guys. You probably won't be able to see me now, but I can see you. Okay, guys, so we're finished with our hearts, so now we're gonna compact our joint, and then later on, we're gonna come back and do our wire brush. So we're just gonna just go try and compact our joint just like so. Yeah, so it's very important to have this one and this one the same size. As you see, they are, they are the same size. Make sure you have a keystone in the middle, in the center of the window. Make sure you have a keystone in the center of the window. Okay, guys. Well, there you have it. If you get value from this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And subscribe for more fun video like this one. I hope you get value from this video where I show you guys how to, how to um, build a stone arch. I have lots of other video where I'm building stone arch as well. If you don't get everything that you feel you need from this one, go and check out some other video. I'll leave a link up in the description. Up. I'll leave a link up top here. Check that video out and you'll see another arch that I was building. Peace out, be safe, and I'll see you in the next one.